Guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Mike is here. Uh, today we're heading to New York City, the Big Apple, because I'm crazy. And it's snowing over there. I'm here with my friend Tony. I'm blessed up one. I'm blessed up one too. <laughs> DJ Doro, aka DJ Doro, Tony here. So we're heading to New York City. <laughs> And uh, our flight is about two hours, and uh, I got my tablet. Two what hours? You... In a two hours time. It's... Oh, okay. I know the flight is two hours. No, no, it's in about two hours time. All right. I got my tablet, <laughs> and I watch movies, or you will go to sleep, one of the two. Yeah. <laughs> it's a long flight, six hours. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll catch you guys at the airport. So uh, Uber is here, let's get going. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My son is taking the video, he's gonna stay here and watch the house for me. Yeah, you have the kids. You have kids. <laughs> yeah, you can have the house for yourself. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't party too much. Of course. Yeah. I don't think you party in my house, do you? <laughs> don't burn the house down too. <laughs> yeah, we're going to New York for New Year's Eve. We're going to enjoy New Year's in New York. What's the ball drop? Uh, so we just decided to take our own vehicle and leave it at the airport. Uh, Right now is about uh, 9.45 p.m. Our flight leaves in about uh, almost two hours time. It was actually delayed. There was so much uh, uh, snow in New York City, so they're delaying the flight. And we got our flight delayed, and that's why we came late. Uh, but right now we are at the parking garage, and I'm about to get a parking ticket. And we're going to leave the vehicle here. It's uh, It's 30 dollars per day. We'll be gone for about two, maybe two, three days. So that's going to be about uh, 60 to $90. And uh, uh, compared to Uber from my house to the airport, is it's about $45 one way. So going back and forth is about the same price. So we ended up just uh, driving our own vehicle to the airport. And we're going to leave it here right at the parking garage and walk right to the terminal for our flight to New York City. We we fly JetBlue. JetBlue is a cheap airline, the budget airline. I paid about $300 round trip to New York City. And we're just going to leave our vehicle here and get our bags and take it inside the airport. So many people here. Why do you JFK. Big Apple. Mm -hmm. The Big Apple. <laughs> Where is that one? Yeah. Hey. JFK. Okay. <laughs> you don't have tall buildings mm. that you never seen before. <laughs> uh, so apparently, I never been to China, but my friends thinks in uh, Shanghai, China, the even taller building than New York City. Uh, I never been to China, but. Uh, I'll go by his word. I've never been there. So we'll see how it goes and see how tall the buildings in New York City are. So this JetBlue flight is uh, like a pick and drop. You're waiting for the other passengers to come off the flight so you can board the next flight. You know what? You get what you pay for. So uh, the flight was delayed because the incoming flight was delayed. And you have to wait for the passengers to come out so we can get on it. He's seated on the floor. There's no seats here. Just waiting to get on the flight. Um, the last flight just came from New York a few minutes ago. They have to wait for the people to come out the flight and then we we'll go in. But I got my boarding pass right here. Just waiting on the floor. You have anything to say? You excited to see GFK? See New York, tall buildings? Uh, so finally we see it on the plane. It took forever for us to get on this plane and we're just waiting for it to take off. So finally, Ooh. we made it to New York City. As you can see from the outside, the weather is perfect. It's 6 a.m. in the morning. Uh, it doesn't seem to be snowing. I know there was uh, all kind of news like New York would be snowing, but what they meant was New York State, not New York City, because New York is both a state and a city. Uh, the weather is nice, so we're getting off the flight, and we're going to get on a train that will take us to downtown uh, New York City. Manhattan. I'm going to take you guys to Times Square itself and just show you guys around New York City. So go with me and I'll show you how New York looks.
all is wanted to go for a Broadway show. One day, I saw my back at least too. About to get off this airport. Sky train that will connect you to all the terminals at JFK. So once you arrive at a JFK, you have to get on the air train, the small train, take you around all the terminals, or you can actually connect it to the main train that will take you to downtown New York or Newark or wherever you are going. I love New York. I love New York. Let's go get on the subway. Go check out New York City. Oh, so coming up is a TWA Transworld Airlines Hotel. It's on uh, Terminal 3 at JFK. Uh, they have a replica of a Concord flight that was for TWA. TWA went bankrupt like 20, 30 years ago. Manhattan. Oh, oh there's Kenya Airways Terminal 4. Uh, so if you're flying Kenya Airways from JFK, you have to go to Terminal 4. Use the air train. So we're gonna take the E train to Manhattan. But before we do that, we have to take another train to Jamaica and connect at Jamaica, Jamaica, Queens. All right, Jamaican train to Manhattan connection here. Here we go. If you want to rent a car at JFK, just rent it from here. Get on the train and get on the rental car place. Next stop is Jamaica. So we need to get off. I'm in Jamaica. I'm in Jamaica, New York. <laughs> so the subway we used to go to Long Island, Manhattan. But before we do that, you have to buy the ticket. You have to buy tickets. Yeah, you have to buy the tickets, eight dollars for ticket to Subway. Yes, you have to scan your ticket for you to exit here. Buy the ticket here for the metro train. English Metro card. Get a new card. Air train process. Yeah, card. 
Poetas dip, dip, dip. o poetas. Pero aquí le va a dar moneda. No importa, aquí está All right, we got our metro ticket here and we're about to get on this uh, Manhattan train. So we are walking down the rail station. Uh, we actually got our metro tickets and uh, there's homeless people out here. It's, it's New York City. So if you see the homeless people, just uh, excuse excuse them. That's, uh, if I was homeless, I was, I'll live out here because it's nice and warm and people will give you handouts. So why not? So the Manhattan train is on track one. Express train to the station, now out of track one. This is the train here. Track one to get us to Manhattan, Penn State. My train here, truck one. Take me to Manhattan. Ooh. Look at this. So this express train will take us to Penn Station in Manhattan. It's much quicker, faster, and more convenient. Not a lot of people and more spacious. It's like SGR. Yeah, 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 me. Well, this place is confusing. Oh, look at this. I wish SGR was like this. <laughs> New York, New York is an old city. But if I go to Manhattan, you see all the tall buildings. to exit here, go to downtown New York, Manhattan. Uh, so we are at Penn Station, New York, and uh, we use the express train because I got confused where to but to take the subway for the E train and I got on the express train, but it's much faster and quicker and no stopping over. But here we are, downtown Manhattan. <laughs> New York, city that never sleeps. This is downtown New York. That's what they have for that parade at. Thanksgiving parade. It's the biggest missus in the world. It's big. All this, this missus. Every floor, different department. So this are the barricades to close the streets for New Year's Eve. We have the street closed here for the ball dropping. Hope for us to be around. But might get so cold, I might leave the hell out of this place. Last time I came here for New Year's Eve, it was snowing so bad. I'm glad the weather is pretty good right now. Oh, we 
look at that graffiti. It's been almost 15 years since I came to New York City and when I came that time I went for New Year's Eve to see the celebration, the ball dropping and it was freezing, I'm telling you. Uh, I've never experienced so much snow in my life. I was cold, uh, my, my head was pain yeah, from all that to... cold, my arms were frozen. So I'm headed to Times Square. It's coming up in the next 1,000 feet. It's the middle of New York, Times Square. So everything happens on New Year's Eve. That was like a half a mile walk from Penn Station to Times Square. But if I use a subway, uh, it could have took me straight to Times Square. But since I got confused, I took the express train. I had to walk half a mile. But I think that's better because I saved on time. gonna go for sightseeing you can get on all the buses and go on sightseeing uh, underneath here the subway I can hear the subway moving underground and there's Murife Murife made it to New York City <laughs> All right, here we are, Times Square, downtown New York City, and just have to find a place to stay for the night and enjoy ourselves out here. So if you took the E-Train, the subway E-Train from Jamaica, it would have taken us straight to Times Square. And this is the entrance or the exit for Times Square. If you take the E-Train from Jamaica, or wherever you are connecting from so but since we took the Penn Station Express train we had to walk around for half a mile uh, walking is good anyway that's exercise and you see more of New York City I enjoy those seats on the Express train they're very comfortable it's like you're on a plane it's not like the ones you have a SGR the face me darling kind those are very uncomfortable Hello, Spider-Man. So you can take a picture of uh, Spider-Man, it's free, or you just have to do is tip them. Oh, is that Mario? Empire State Building. And the Lion King on uh, 45th Street. I always wanted to watch a Broadway show. Yeah, smoking weed is legal here because all I can do is smell weed. People smoking weed on the streets at downtown New York Times Square. What can you <laughs> yeah, I can smell New York Times Square 2023. So they're gonna have all the performance out here. It's gonna be crazy. All the barricades, the police who close this place down. And uh, you never know, I might be I might be still be here, you know. That's in two days, right? I must still be around.
New York, New York, the city that never sleeps. All right, guys, I hope you like my video of New York City. If you have a New York and you have a long layover at JFK, I gave you directions of how to get to downtown New York. Just go ahead and explore New York City. Hey, it's a free exploration, right, when you wait for your next flight. Anyway, guys, uh, if you're watching my video for the first time, I hope you consider subscribing. And to my subscriber, thank you for your support. And I'll catch you in my next video. Take care, guys.